selection in AutoCAD is done by clicking the element you want to select. If you add another element, click another element. Let's select the circle. If you want to unselect or deselect an element, press shift mouse button and keep it pressed while you click on the element you want to unselect. Let's unselect the circle and the rectangle. The second way to select objects in AutoCAD is with a rectangle. In order to do that, you have to click somewhere on the screen for the first corner of the rectangle and move your mouse cursor over the screen and click for the second corner of the selection. Click for the first corner of the selection and click it for the second corner. Of the rectangle. The third way is selecting with lasso tool. To do that you have to press left mouse button and keep it pressed and move over the elements you want to select and when you release the left mouse button selection is done. As you notice I hope when we select coming from the right to left this rectangle is with green and we, when we come from left to right is with blue. What means that? Blue means that every object totally included in this rectangle or in the lasso or in the polygon, we will see later, so everything totally included will be selected, while uh, green means everything touched by the green rectangle will be selected. Green rectangle, green polygon and lasso. The other way of selection are starting from the rectangle selection. So we have to click for the first corner of the rectangle. And down in the command bar we have three options. Fence, W polygon, C polygon. So we will type F for the first option and press enter. Now as you can see a dotted line comes that represent a kind of fence and that means everything crossed by this fence will be selected. I will click because I want to change the direction to select the rectangle. You can select in one point, in multiple points it will be selected. I will change again the direction to get selected this line and in the end I will go to the circle to select it. I will click somewhere there and I will select the other line. When everything is selected this way, press enter to finish selection. And as you can see, every element crossed by that line is selected. Let's go further. Click once more again for the first corner of the rectangle and select the second option that is WP, press enter. And as you can see, there is a line creating that will be the first side of the polygon. Click. Select the second side of the polygon and click and move as you want to create a polygon. When you think everything is done, you have to press enter to finish selection. Once more again, click for the first corner of the rectangle, type WP, press enter, create the first side of the polygon, the second side, the third side of the polygon and so on. And when you think it's done, press enter to finish the selection. As you can see, it doesn't matter this time if you come from the left to the right or if you come from the right to the left with W polygon, everything is blue. It doesn't matter the point you start. Now let's get to the third option. We have to click somewhere on the screen for the first corner of rectangle selection and we will type CP and press enter. And is the same as the previous. Click for the first side of the rectangle and as you can see now CP means green rectangle selection. Green means everything touch is selected. Now we will come from the left to right. Polygon start to be in blue. We will type CP press enter. We will click for the first side of the polygon and as you can see it doesn't matter if you come from the left to right or from the right to the left. Selection is in green and in green everything touch is selected. Let's recap the lesson selection in AutoCAD. The first and the basic way is to click on that element. 
you want to select. The second way is using lasso tool. You will have to left mouse button press and keep it down while uh, you move on the screen your mouse cursor and make the selection. When you release the left mouse button, selection is done. The third way is with a rectangle. You will have to click for the first corner and you will have to click for the opposite corner to finish the selection. Also, when you start with a rectangle selection tool, you have three options, fence, W polygon and C polygon. So click somewhere on the screen to start with rectangle selection tool, type F, press enter. This is the first option and a dotted line will come and every element crossed by this line will be selected. Press enter to finish the selection. The second option of rectangle is W polygon. You have to click for the first corner of the rectangle selection, type WP, press enter. That means polygon shape for selection. And select the first side of the polygon, the second, the third, and so on. And when everything you consider to be done, press enter to finish selection. And the third option is C polygon. You will have to click for the first corner of the rectangle, then type CP, press enter, select the first line of the polygon, the second, and select all the sides of the polygon and everything is done. Press enter to make selection. We also have to remind ourselves that blue means every element included totally will be selected, while green means every element touched by the green selection will be selected. Also to unselect an element we will have to keep press shift button while we will click on the elements we want to unselect. Thank you.